Hello and welcome to Irish Football Fan TV. This is Road to Glory. This is basically Series 2 and we're playing Pro Evolution Soccer 2020 and we're playing a classic National League against 20 other teams or well, sorry, we're the 20 of the other 19 teams. We're the 20th. So we're playing against the likes of classic Argentina, classic Germany, Brazil, France, Spain, Croatia, Belgium, Italy, you name it. We're playing the classic teams um, and obviously we're playing as Ireland. So we're playing a league. So this is the very, very first game. So make sure you check it out. Let us know what you think of it. Don't forget to drop a like on the video. And uh, we'll get straight into it and load the league I've made. So basically I've imported over the teams I, on YouTube. I can't remember. I'll link the... Uh, the guy's name in the description who uh, who actually imported the, uh, the Irish file and uh, you can get the other teams and you can do it yourself as well but uh, you may as well check it out check out the uh, so here we go right so here's the team lineup okay um, so as you can see there there's the team uh, Robbie Keane Frank Stapleton Damien Duff uh, you got Liam Brady Ray Houghton Roy Keane um, Paul McGrath, Kevin Moore, Dennis Irwin, Steve Staunton, Packy Bonner, David O'Leary, Steve Finnan, Ian Hart, Andy Townsend, Kevin Sheedy, John Joyce, Steve Hoyway, John Aldridge, Alan Kelly, Mark Lawrenson, I think that's uh, Jackie Kerry, um, John O'Shea, Ronnie Whelan, Noel Quinn, Tony Cascarino, I think that's Jimmy Dunn. I'm going to bring uh, Ronnie Whelan. I've edited some of the players to the rating that I think they would have been in their prime. So the likes of Ronnie Whelan was an 83, I moved him up to an 87, because I looked at some other teams and their players in their prime were far better than they actually were, in my opinion. So I just thought it even it up, but I didn't do it that like to that many players. So a lot of players are actually quite, you know, I didn't touch Kevin Moran or Dennis Irwin or Steve Staunton, but a couple of the other lads I moved. Damien Duff was already an 88, I didn't touch him, but you know, Roy Keane was an 83, so I moved him up to a 90, which I thought was only fair. Um, so that's the formation. I'll play 4 3 3 with John Giles, uh, Liam Brady, and Roy Keane in midfield, some midfield. So yeah, we're going to get straight into Frank Stapleton up top. Uh, Robbie just on the right of him. So here we go. Now, let's let look at the kits here as well, because they're absolutely beautiful. So look, obviously, you can see their kit there. That's their away kit. Um, oh that's nice I'll let them play on that and then that's the other one so we let them play in that strip and we'll play we'll play in that strip how good does that look try that body gown active plus fitness it's fantastic Right, here we go. Classic Republic of Ireland versus Classic Germany. Oh, well done, Staunton. So, Roy Keane in this game is absolutely class as a defensive midfielder. Oh, just as I say, he gives the ball away. But. Damien Duff, oh! All of that calm with the save. We recently watched the uh, uh, the Germany and Republic of Ireland game from 2002, and all of that can in that game was unbelievable. Oh, Duff! He was unbelievable in that game, and Ireland just couldn't score. And obviously, Robbie did in like the final seconds, but like he was unbelievable in that game. Unbelievable. I added Frank Stapleton to be a bit better as well, but if, if anybody's seen Frank Stapleton play, in the, obviously I didn't, but people have told me. So I moved him up to an 87, and same with John Aldridge, because John Aldridge was playing with the Liverpool team that were winning everything in the 80s, and like in Europe and everything like that. So I don't see how you can't make him, he was an 84, so I just made him a bit better. Oh, great ball by Duff. Oh, Liam Brady? Oh, come on, up you go. Strike again. Oh, well defended. Hope you get Steve Staunton. You boy, yeah. I'm the gaffer. It's 
Close down. Oh, yes. Kevin Moore. Player. So a lot of maybe younger players would only probably not, or younger fans would probably only know Damien Duff, uh, Shea Given, and Robbie Keane. But, you know, Steve Staunton, uh, people always go on. People have seen him, you know, back in his pump. I was just saying how good he was and up there with our best left backs of all time. Uh, Ian Hart's obviously on the bench there, but I had to put Steve Staunton in his pump. Was uh, as, And everybody, like you look at the clubs he played for as well. Liverpool and Villa. Um, I think Liverpool re-signed him as well. Or was it one or the other or Villa? But he went there, done very well. Oh, well done, Shay Given. Save from Schweinsteiger. That jersey is beautiful. And get it away, lads. Paul McGrath as well in this game. <laughs> Unbelievable. I love about this game, though, is he, he can fly into challenges, which is great, obviously. Is that Paul McGrath? Far side. Oh, Robbie King. Oh, Robbie unlucky. And these Germans are good. Oh, the difficulty as well uh, in this game is... Um, this is just under what legendary you will be in FIFA, so whatever that is. I think it's I think it's called top player. And I think the next level up is superstar. So I only got this game last week. I paid twenty quid for it, and I bought it lot on the PlayStation Network, and it's just brilliant. Like the gameplay, and you can not only can you do like the legends. What you can do is you can actually play like the nineteen ninety eight uh, Man United team that won the treble with uh, you know Beckham and all them. And you can play with their jersey, you know, the Umbro with the Umbro on the sleeves and the classics. Uh, they have Chelsea's uh, really great team as well, uh, Barcelona and so on. So you can make a, like a little league of it as well. And it's just, oh, it's just, it's quality. The gameplay is far better than FIFA as well, I think. Switch to play there. Well played. Dennis Irwin, by the way. Oh, he's just sensational. The thing is, you could play Irwin left back as well. I think when we did our all time 11 at that time, uh, Irwin got in as a left back. But obviously, in this, he's playing as a right back. He played more as a right back. Roy Keane, brilliant. Oh, Duff. Lovely bit of skill. Oh, yes, Duffer. Corner, get a corner. Oh, that's well done, Duffer. What? That's a goal key. <sighs> Come on, Duffer. Ah, uh, needs to be better than that. I think the best thing about this as well is you get to play against. Uh, you get to play against um oh, I forgot what I was gonna say. A really good thing from him. Got distracted there by your message. Um Oh yeah, I remember what I was gonna say now. So basically you get uh you get to play against the best teams, but you also get to play with a really good Ireland team. So obviously in the road to glory when I won the Euros, it wasn't the best Irish team, so it wasn't as enjoyable because just the team wasn't that good and it was more of a struggle than, you know, enjoyable. But with this, like, pretty much all the players are good. Yeah, well, obviously because they're legends, but the... Duffer! Oh, miles over. I think for the next game, I'll turn off the commentary. Actually, I'll just turn it off now. So now people always ask for me to turn it off, so I'll just turn off the commentary. And the music. So it'll just be me commentating now, yeah. Oh no. Stand them up. Oh well done, Denny Irwin. Animal. Robbie Keane. Oh, 
Oh, Brady. Oh. All right, we need a break. Okay, half time, nil nil. Uh, hasn't been much chances really. Uh, that boise boys kick from uh, Damien Duff went over the bar, but other than that, it's not really been a whole lot. So, we've had more possession. They've had one, so four shots on target, we've had one. Okay. Well, we can go into the second half. Second half, kicking off. Robbie Keane, oh well done, corner kick. Liam Brady with the delivery, can we get on it? Back out to him, back out to him, back out to him. Oh. I just love the slow attackers in this game, like when you hit someone, you probably feel like you've actually, you know, in real life tackled them, it's great. Just like, maybe it's the vibration of the controller, but. You just get that crunch and feel. And I'll, I'll actually, when you when you miss <laughs> trying to challenge as well, you can kind of feel it. Oh, yes. Right. Ah, lucky. Robbie Keane's passing. Stand him up. Roy Keane is just so good in this game. Though. Oh, Denny. Love it. Right. We need some support there, lads. Help Robbie out. There's a guy. That's so straight. Danny Irwin putting up the grass here. Come on. Brain, I think he's a good player, Sammy. Some of the players there, Beck and Bauer, unbelievable players. Lower on the tails. Obviously, in his pomp was, was unbelievable. And I think it's Andre Brainer. He was very good as well. Just a very tough German team they were back then. Like, obviously, they all didn't play together, but if you, if you look at them all in the division, they're all very good. They're very good clubs as well. Ah, Limo, come on. Oh, we're bringing on a sub. They're bringing on Klinsman. <laughs> I wonder, do we have, can we bring on someone of that quality? Right, I'm going to bring on Aldridge for a staple thing. And I'm going to go 4 4 2 now. Just because I think we'll get a goal if we do that. So, who comes off? Uh, the three amigos. I suppose it's going to have to be Giles. I'm going to move him back. We're going to take Duffer off and we're going to bring on Cam Sheedy. At left midfield is an 85. Um, and then Houghton for Giles. Play him there and then Liam Brady can just tuck in the middle there. Actually, no. Just to even the things up a little bit, but just do that. Right. Come on, Aaron. <laughs> Liam Brady with the delivery for Robbie Keane. Oh! <sighs> I'm lucky. Keen in over the top. Oh. 
See the difference when you go 4-4-2 four, 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 straight away and you know, do these little give and goes. Robbie's a master getting in behind of these positions. Oh, my God. But, are you for real? That is the wrong stupid decision about it to me. Yeah. 20 minutes left. You just have to be careful, you don't give away any stupid fouls on the edge of the box because I've, I've given this game a couple of practice runs and if you give any good teams a shot from the uh, edge of the box, free kick area basically, uh, they, they always punish you. Especially because we're playing against legends and all of unbelievable team, uh, players. Oh, no. Break him. No! Fuck's oh, sake. Garrett Muller. He scores goals. The one time we leave ourselves open. Where is that centre back? Shea Given sent the wrong way as well. Come on. Bring on Thomas Hassler, I think his name is. Alright, come on, Sheets. Who's your face? Where is. Where's Lou? Oh. I hit the phone with that Nemo. And the difference with the break they can bring on someone like Kingsman, who is unbelievable to say they give him. I still have most of the possession. And away. So hit Shady, get on it. Oh, it's broken. It's on his bad foot to be fair. But still. We need better deliveries into the big men in the box. Ah, Stan, get the run around. Literally. And McGrath. Well done, Denny Irwin. Come on, look the pitch. That's it, Johnny. Ah, it's shocking. Oh, that's gonna blow up now. Oh my god. That's, that's disgraceful. <sighs> ah, we're on the break. Oi, disappointing. A 1 0 loss against Classic Germany. I don't think you can really fault the, the team. Classic Germany are unbelievable. But uh, 1 0, I mean, lots and lots of games to play. Uh, we can still make it back up. Uh, so let me know your thoughts in the comments. Have you have you enjoyed seeing the players that you've seen playing in the team? I mean, you look at that. I don't think we deserve to lose that game, to be fair. But look, we'll see who we have next. And yeah, so some of the other scores, some of the results there are crazy. All right. So we're sitting 12th after the first game. So, look, we lost the first game. Just going to have to get on. So we play Classic England next, which obviously is uh, is one game to look forward to. Uh, let us know your thoughts in the comments. And uh, if do you think I should include the whole game or should I take bits and parts out of the game? 
uh, like highlights and stuff like that. Uh, make it less, I suppose, not as long. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, we'll speak to you soon. Thanks for watching.